Creative note distribution. Let me explain what I mean by that. We are going to take one chord, for example, and I'm going to show you five places on the fretboard where you can place that one minor pentatonic box and make it sound different in each of those five positions. Now, creative note just distribution happens because each of the notes within the patterns in the different locations will be different. So you can play the same lick, but you're going to get different results. Now, let me show you what I mean by that over a very simple example. We're going to take an A7 chord, for example, and I'm going to play F sharp minor pentatonic here, and then I'm going to move it to the 5th fret, and I'm going to go... And you can hear that's still working, but the notes are very different. I've distributed my notes differently within those patterns now. I'm going to move it up to the 12th fret one more time for you guys, so... Very similar licks in three different positions on the fretboard and it's given me different results. That's what I mean by distributing the notes in a very creative way. You've had to learn nothing new. It's the one scale pattern that we all know, but I'm going to give you different places to get different options and different sounds now. So no more box boredom. You're going to creatively distribute your licks and get five more values out of each one of those.